right. So this is this is one uh, thing. Paul, what are you doing with that piece of wire in yeah, your hand? I said to bear the ends, so I've done it. <laughs> right, can you be love and connect it up to that? Those two bare, bare wires coming off that solenoid. Well, son. Hi YouTubers, uh, welcome back to the uh, WTF and today, this afternoon, on this beautiful sunny afternoon here in South Wales, we're going to run up a little gas turbine engine. What I have here is a auxiliary power unit originally fitted to a BA146 aircraft. Um, it's a small uh, single shaft uh, gas turbine and it has two purposes. One is it uh, drives an electrical generator, which uh, on this particular one is sadly missing, but it also has an air bleed port. It provides compressed air for aircraft starting and other aircraft uh, purposes such as uh, air conditioning. So we've tried the engine before, we've run the engine a few times, but we haven't yet operated this valve and it's hopefully uh, we intend in the future to potentially use this engine to start um, a larger uh, jet engine, maybe like this one here, the uh, spay engine, which is hiding underneath uh, that uh, tarpaulin. So this afternoon, we're simply going to uh, operate a couple of valves and uh, check out, see how it works. And uh, I put a special plate in here, an orifice plate, to limit uh, the amount of compressed air which is discharged from the engine um, uh, because uh, if it discharges excessive amounts of air, it may run too hot, and we don't want to do that. So uh, let's uh, let's see how we uh, get on. Brilliant. Let's crack on then, old chap.
think it works, but my smoking stick uh, didn't really work so well. Oh, no. Well, yeah, it gets hot, but no, Jesus. What temperature is it going up to? Yeah, it's going up to about 650. So it's getting very hot.